So, in this video, I want to share with you five signs to tell you that your business is ready for scale. Now, I know most of us don't know when are we actually ready for scale and most of us are waiting for some kind of indication from the heavens above. But guess what? The heavens have heard your prayers and that's why I'm making this video on five signs for you to know that your business is ready for scale. Hi, my name is Rajiv Talreja and as a business coach, I work with thousands of entrepreneurs to help them scale up their business. And I work with entrepreneurs who are right from farmers to tech startups. So the variety of businesses that I come across in my journey as a business coach is absolutely enriching for me. And what I want to do is I want to break down for you from this enriching experience of working with thousands of entrepreneurs from 182 different types of industries. What have been my lessons about five key indicators or five signs for you to look out for, which tells you that your business is ready for scale. So let's dive into this video, make a lot of notes and don't ignore these five signs because this is a voice from the heavens. Now, I also want you to note one thing that as I take you through this video, you need to write these points down so that you can reflect on them after the video is done and take action on them in your business. And watch this video till the end, not just for the five signs that tells you that your business is ready for scale, but watch this video till the end because I have a special invitation for you which I will share with you towards the end of the video, which will actually help you scale your business. So make sure you watch the video till the end. And let's dive into the five signs to tell you that your business is ready for scale. The first sign for you to know as an indicator that your business is actually ready for you to scale it up and take it to the next level is if your customers are your raving fans. If your customers love the quality of your product or service, it means you've got the core ingredient right. It means you've created a product or service which is solving a significant problem for your target customer or fulfilling a significant need or desire for them. Now, when you have a great quality product or service as a result of which your customers are your raving fans and they love your product or service, that means you have earned the right now to scale the business. That means this product or service deserves to become a household name and deserves to be used everywhere in every part of the world by as many people as it can add value to you. So the first indicator is if you have customers appreciating the quality of your products and services. That's an indicator for you to know that you need to start thinking about how can I scale it. The second indicator for you to know if your business is ready for scale is if you are generating consistent income which means you as a business have reached a stage of stability. You're no longer firefighting for month to month survival. Your sales is smooth, your inflows are smooth, you're sitting on a healthy cash flow, you're making decent profit margins for your business and somewhere through all this consistency and stability, business is becoming a little boring. Think about it. That's a good sign. It tells you that this level is complete. Now it's time for you to look at the next level. And that's an indicator for you to start thinking about scale. Stability is a great indicator as a great nudge for you to remind yourself that, hey, it's time for me to play bigger. It's time for me to think about what's the next level of the business. So indicator number one is extremely happy customers who love your product or service. Indicator number two to tell you that you're ready for scale is stability of income and good profitability and healthy cash flows. Which brings me to the third sign to tell you that you're ready for scale. The third sign for you to know that you're ready for scale is when you're receiving many requests from people, outsiders, random people in the industry, you're receiving requests from them for collaborations. Think about it. Opportunities come to the talented ones. They don't come to the people who are not talented. So if you are receiving a lot of interest from people in the industry, in your domain, in your sector, where they want to reach out to you, they want to catch up with you, they want to know what you're up to, they want to share some ideas with you, they want to explore collaborations with you, that's a good enough indicator for you to know that the word has spread and people are noticing your work. And it's probably time for you to notice your worth and start thinking about the next level. Talent attracts opportunities. Remember that. It doesn't mean you take up every opportunity that comes your way. It doesn't mean you network with everybody. It doesn't mean that you entertain and partner with anybody and everybody. But it's a good indicator for you to know that, hey, I have become a somebody now. 
now it's time for me to think at the next level now it's time for me to consider what are my strategies and what is my pathway to scale my business so that's the third indicator for you to know that your business is ready for scale which brings me to the fourth indicator for you to know whether your business is ready for scale and the fourth sign for you to know that your business is ready for scale is when your team members are producing results in their departments but they are also complaining of boredom of doing the same work over and over again again and again think about it if your team members are producing results in their departments it means they've mastered their craft it means they've mastered the skills for their role but they are also feeling boredom because human beings are machines of growth we crave for growth we love growth so if your team members are complaining of boredom even though they are doing their job well it's time for you to challenge them with a next level challenge it's time for you to challenge yourself with a next level business challenge so that's a fourth indicator for you to know that you are ready for scale which brings me to the fifth and final sign to let you know that your business is ready for scale and the fifth and final sign to let you know that your business is ready for scale is if you as a business owner are no longer involved in day to day activities of different departments if you as a business owner don't have to play the game of firefighting and crisis management in different departments that's the biggest indicator for you to know that now is the time for you to explore the next level of the business now is the time for you to create a vision for the future which is compelling enough and challenging enough to move the entire business outside its comfort zone so ladies and gentlemen these are the five signs for you to know that your business is ready for scale let's review them one by one and then i will tell you what's the next step that you need to take to explore this scaling up of your business first your customer loves your products or services it means you've got the core aspect of business right and it means now you need to amplify this product or service and make it reach whoever deserves to use this and benefit from it second when you are having a patch of stability when you know that stability is become the new normal and you have consistent cash flows consistent profitability stability is an indicator that it's time to prepare for scale third sign when you are receiving many requests from people in your industry for collaborations for connecting for networking that's an indicator that people are recognizing your capabilities and talents and it's time you recognize your capabilities and talents fourth when your team members are producing results in the work that they do but they're also experiencing boredom because nothing is exciting them anymore and fifth when you are no longer involved in day to day activities of departments these are the five signs for you to know that your business is ready for scale now you may have a question so rajiv in what direction do i scale my business what do i need to do next so here's what i need you to do next for you to explore how to scale your business i need you to click on the link below and register yourself for my upcoming 4 hour live training called the business breakthrough seminar because this is where i break down for you what are the aspects of scaling a business how to build a business which can grow without you and how to build a stable and successful business watch this video till the end so that you get more details about the business breakthrough seminar but at the end of the video make sure you click on the link in the caption and i look forward to seeing you in the 4 hour business breakthrough seminar to be able to serve you to scale your business see you there i started my journey as an entrepreneur in the year 2006 and when i started my journey as an entrepreneur in the year 2006 i started with big goals big dreams big plans but very soon those big goals big dreams and big plans shrunk in size and the focus of building my business became month to month survival i started four companies out of which i had to shut two companies down in the year 2012 when i went through a 70 lakh loss and i earned myself a 45 lakh rupee debt that's when i realized that something has to change this has nothing to do with the business i'm building it has a lot to do with my capabilities as a business owner and therefore in 2014 i committed myself to a research project where i went across india and i interviewed 300 business leaders people like kiran mazumdar shah who's built biocon people like ashok suta who's built happiest minds technologies people like ck kumarwel who built natural salon as india's largest chain of salon and i asked them two questions what is the strategy of building a profitable scalable business and what is the system to set track and achieve goals in every department of the business 
asking these two questions to 300 business leaders opened my mind to a whole world of possibilities where I realized the biggest mistake I was making as a business owner was I was doing everything in my business. This has been the mistake of most entrepreneurs. One of my biggest lessons was that if you're the best on your team, if you're the most intelligent person on your team, then you cannot build a scalable business because you get involved in everything and you get stuck in day-to-day -day firefighting. Taking these lessons, I designed a four-hour live training called the Business Breakthrough Seminar where I break down for my participants what are the seven foundational activities to build a stable and successful business so that they have clarity on what they need to initiate in their business for better stability and focus on growth. I also break down for my participants on what is their role as a business owner. Because as a business owner, if you are in chaos, if you are confused, then that chaos and confusion spreads across your team. And I also will break down what are the three things that you need to focus on to build a business which can grow without you. More than 70,000 participants have attended more than 175 business breakthrough seminars from across 13 different countries. And out of these 70,000 entrepreneurs, 99.3% of entrepreneurs have responded saying that the business breakthrough seminar was extremely relevant and practical for their business. These are staggering statistics to let you know that you need to be the next participant at the Business Breakthrough Seminar. And I'd love to work with you on helping you identify how can you grow your business and build something that is scalable and profitable. I look forward to seeing you there. Make sure you click on the link and register yourself right now.